foot to shoulder. <laughs> so when I say foot to shoulder, I mean <laughs> flyers. But I always, for me, I teach with the flyers body part to the basis body part. So my foot to my shoulder. Now let's go, Magda. Right let's get up. Why would we start high? Bring it down. <laughs> Bring it low. Bring it down first. So we're starting here. I'm on my. Uh, I'm in a squatting on my shins. Jason, I, last time we did, as you say, it was deep on your thigh. So we put a yoga block underneath. So that can assist for that too, okay? So keep that in mind. Um, coming up. Let's demonstrate what can happen with a fall. So I'm going on, foot on the shoulder. Stepping up. Oh, I'm falling backwards. Right? So you can totally fall back. What can you do to prevent that tugging backwards? Watch what I'm doing with my hands. Let's break it down. I'm squaring my arms here, so when she's pour, pouring weight, she's pouring weight into my hands, so I'm pushing up as she's doing that, giving her that support. So she's going to say squat it for first. Say squat it low, because this is safer. If she falls, she's already at a low position. Let's get here first today. Let's see how that feels. So I'm constantly pushing up. She's pushing down. If you feel good from there, watch your heels. She's going to bring her heels together. And then from there, I can transfer if she'll stand up. I'm constantly pushing up with her. Be mindful of falling back. She wants to put a lot of weight into the hands first. She's leaning forward a bit. There you go. So I'm pushing up with her. Then I can slowly walk my hand towards her calf. Hand toward her calf. And her heels are together. And then the last thing I do is my head goes against her shins there. So I'm clamping, my arms are going forward and my head's going back. So I'm creating that clamp. I'm looking up, back towards her. And the whole time I'm, she's squeezing her butt, her thighs, keeping her tight. I'm doing the same as squeezing my butt and my thighs and keeping my core tight. I'm imagining there's a string up on my uh, back of my neck, it's lifting me up. I'm nice and straight and strong. My head's going backwards, my arm's going forward, bringing a clamp. The getting up isn't actually the hard part, it's the getting down. Always it's the coming down sometimes that's harder than getting up. She's squatting, getting low first is the first important thing. I give her a hand so she can lean into it. She's looking forward the whole time, because if she looks down, she'll fall down too quick. Look forward and reach down. I feel the weight into the hands there. She can slowly squat even further. And then put a foot on my thigh forward. Go back. There he is. Going backwards again. Yeah. We can also go dismount forward too. If she's here, she can just simply jump forward as well. Which may be even easier as long as you're being able to push off the hands there. Okay. Anything to clarify? Ooh, let's do it. Well, maybe one thing. Yes. Can you do that? From, from a kneeling position? Yeah, I think yeah. so. Okay. That'll be fair. <laughs> Good point.